uh, they checked the the problem for us. So we even do not have uh, uh, you know lights and uh, refrigerate is leaking. <laughs> so everything you know for the temperature right now is just a terrible. Anyway, sorry about the, the um, eventually we solved it yesterday. And uh, Henry got back the uh, computer um, late afternoon and uh, sent the uh, handout very late. Sorry about that. Okay. okay. Well, you take care, okay? Yeah, thank you. Thank Please you. Please take care. <laughs> thank you. Yeah. <laughs> we understand. I mean, it's terrible when we see it on the news. It's terrible. Yes, because yeah. first we uh, first we thought um, probably you know there is uh, some something just because of the weather you know the uh, the North California they got the fire something so probably the power shortage and uh, of course um, we got the from got from the information from the news says uh, uh, some like the shortage they were um, announced and without any announcing and we got it every day after. Afternoon, uh, the most hot temperature I got indoor, eighty-eight. <laughs> now that's pretty high. Yep. You know, it's hard to it's hard to concentrate when it's high like that. Right, right, <laughs> and uh, uh, think. <laughs> right, and uh, I I I I record. It's like the seventies when I was in my home home hometown. <laughs> Yeah. The, yeah, the summer. Anyway, um, today we are going to learn uh, um, two word, two word, uh, and uh, this word kind of a big word and also can be uh, small. This bottle. Uh, yeah, and Angie. Uh, I saw 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 you. You are new to our class, so say welcome to Angie. Welcome. Yeah. 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 Welcome, I, Angie. I'm having some computer problems too. I can't find my charger, so my battery might run out. I tried to use my phone, but it didn't seem like it was working. Okay, so you uh, you got hand out this couple of times. Uh, I mean, uh, I put your uh, email on our list, right? Yes. Okay, so um, let's start today's uh, new characters. Okay, uh, first one we are going to learn is the uh, 世界是, um, You know, some characters I said, if only the uh, the straight uh, strokes, like horizontal and vertical, kind of hard actually to write it beautifully. Because you want you you do not want uh, use the ruler to mash it. Um, you want it to look balanced, uh, but become a little bit different in between, uh, a little bit longer. Or where to do that to make the balance is very hard sometimes. Mm -hmm. You know, looks is simple, but very hard. Um, so this is only see vertical and horizontal, let's write it. This is a standard style. So this is uh, the big horizontal one and the kind of this, the one, I um, mean, uh, two strokes of the horizontal one. So first one on the left one is a little bit smaller and this one a little bit longer, taller and uh, stronger. I did a little bit to right actually. And close it. And this a little bit shorter. Mm, not beautiful. See this box too big, too big. 
there is the um, somebody uh, studied um, some kind of the judgment to see what's the beautiful even you do not uh, know the the characters you are judged by the common sense by the common like aesthetic uh, judgment see uh, space should be you know the ne ne negative view if you do um, from the um, aspect see the loss speaks about the same, like the same range, same space should be. There is no reason, see, my one, this one, too big here. See, here, too big. Right, here, too big, yeah. Should be, you know, some, yeah, some wide width they, you know, look at. Even you don't know how to write the characters. This looks kind of too big, so I will write again. But when you write, you look only at the strokes, right? <laughs> so this time. Kind of too long, huh? Hmm. Kind of too long. See, I said it's hard. <laughs> it's correct. Nothing wrong, but just you know, I tell um, as I said, look at the sample, and when you write, only the strokes but you need to always thinking of the whole thing. Whoops. Standard one are the hardest. You need to uh, take care of the single strokes and also the whole thing. And when you write, you know, slower, kind of concentrate on the stroke and you forget, ha ah, ha ha, it's too long again. Too thick. Yeah, this the structure is better, but the strokes kind of not perfect. Anyway, uh, just let you see, I do this also as practice. Okay, I don't know, do not want to anymore. <laughs> Okay, let's look at the, the walking style. Walking style actually a lot different, but lots of people just do that. Um, the uh, very end, the hook, is actually kind of the uh, back um, 
bristle back or ready for the next character because we write it vertically in line, right? Okay, so basically it's the stroke of I analyze it so like that, like that, and like that, and that, the back, and the back a little bit. So I got three, three part, this part on the top, and uh, this part, medium, middle, and then uh, this. <laughs> yeah, put them together, show the connections and do it faster, then become things like the uh, sample. See, this part become a connection, yeah, a little bit, shows a little bit connect, that's it, yeah. And this, 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 a little bit in the back of the uh, bristle, your brush tip, and ready for the next character. So do not make too power um, on purpose to do this hook. So just naturally I kind of back the stroke. Yeah, that's the walking style. And then let's look at the cursive style. Cursive style is from um, walking style and become more um, running style, so-called uh, cursive style. Actually, first, like the cross, the top cross become diag diagonally uh, direction. And then, uh, okay, I an analyze this. See, the cross is not cross straight, but this direction and the connect so I would do that, like that, and then back to this way and bottom one, a little bit back stroke. So like that. Horizontal, diagonal, this direction, diagonal, this direction, and the horizontal, like that. Yeah, the horizontal one, you can do, um, I mean, two horizontal one, you can do a little bit this long, a little bit longer, that a little bit shorter, it doesn't matter. Not a crucial point. Mm Yeah, just feel more fluent when you practice. You need to thinking of the whole thing and to try to do it with your rhythm. Mm -hmm. That's the shi, the word, first word. By itself is also means life, like life or um, generation. And also put together uh, with other character means the world, world. Okay, let's see the other character. 
So this is Jie, the other character for the world. Standard style first, always. So when, when you write on paper, uh, use paper, uh, the calligraphy or paint, normally, you know, smooth side is the uh, place, the side you write on, right? Because always feel it. So when you, um, you cut it, sometimes you fold it and you cut it and you, don't, you do not know. So this is the back side. This is the smooth side. And this is a smooth side, right? When you cut it, you do that, you fold it. So feel it before you decide which side to write on. My brush is getting drier, but I try to do it slower. And uh, instead of uh, to dip in the ink, because I want to finish it like the, do not broken. So this is the uh, a word for uh, uh After those become, those is like two characters put together, top and the uh, bottom. The top one, can you see anything like close to uh, the character we know already? Anybody know that? See, this is, we learned the mouth, right? Did we? The mouth one, right? But the square. <laughs> and uh, put the cross in center. See, this is the top one. Actually, this is the character for uh, field. Field. Does it look like a field? Yes. You know the uh, the fields, the um, peasants work on that work on that to uh, grow rice, wheat, and uh, you know veg vegetables. Vegetables you know, divide in the you know square four squares. So this is the field. This is the field. Um, and the uh, the the bottom the bottom one, uh, the lower part. This part is the chi, the single word by itself. This can be the mesh word. Like the one, one person know one some things. And also um, if you put the, the um, this grass top as radical, we learned like a two sprout, two sprouts, two um, cross on top, we call it like a grass, right? Grass top as radical. So this whole thing together, this is um, mustard, the vegetable mustard, and uh, we have the menu called mustard seeds garden menu, right? The basic painting things, uh, that's the character for mustard, mustard, the green, the vegetables mm -hmm. for mustard. And uh, also, um, I think in um, Chinese painting class, Henry, Henry's class, I think he mentioned, we, when we talk about some certain things, like last class, we talk about what? We talk about the female characters for the, um, the plum tree, right? Plum tree branch, uh, the cross, 
like the character's uh, structure. And also this one, uh, the bottom one, when we learn bamboo, the bamboo leaves in group, um, if you put four bamboo leaves together, uh, the tradition uh, says you should, um, when you look the bamboo leaves, you should see lots of uh, these character, these characters, you know, kind of like the four pieces of bamboo leaves. This is five already. Anyway, so two on top, a little bit, a little bit of slant press shape, and two more straight and uh, uh, vertical looking, you know, kind of four bamboo, sh bamboo leaf, bamboo leaves, <laughs> four pieces. Um, and the structure says some, some, uh, some cross, you know, bamboo leaves in group, right? Always in group when you do bamboo leaves. One, two, three. We have other characters for that. One, two, three, and the fourth one, you know. But how to, you know, some cross, cross here, right? Connect here, and then not, not from the one spot, uh, you know, from other spot. So always say kind of this, kind of these characters. So not from same point, right? This is not, not these characters. <laughs> so anyway, bamboo leaves looking these characters. Anyway, just for fun to tell you. Okay, so this whole 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 thing put together is uh, the world. Makes sense, huh? With the uh, field, but when you write a calligraphy stroke, uh, you do not put this this kind of things uh, absolute uh, square that you do like that. Uh, first, first stroke like that, um, and the uh, horizontal one a little bit thinner, and a little bit up, a little bit up for the top one. Um, the second on the right hand side, the vertical, uh, stronger, but with the direction direction of uh, like the. I always say the big shoulder there are and uh, a little bit, um, you know, center towards the direction for the vertical one on this side, right? This, this shape. Mm -hmm. So a little bit smaller. And then the center cross do not touch two side. Normally leave the right, right hand side a little bit of space there not the perfect touch, uh, not too stiff looking. Mm -hmm. And when you close the bottom one, you do a little bit this side, um, show the starting part. I mean, uh, like kind of stick out. <laughs> so not the perfect square, uh, like I explained. Uh, help you to remember this is the field, the character, exactly the character for field. Okay, that's a standard style. Let's look at the walking style. Hey, this is uh, recognizable, huh? This walking style, uh, you can do it, uh, deli you can deliver it from the walking to the, uh, I mean, from the standard to walking by yourself. So more connection, especially for the, uh, I mean, middle part of the actual bottom characters. Okay, so field, field almost the same, right? And then those two, a little bit, you know, connect. And then 
those two shows the connection. You mean the ten? You know, I mean the tendency of the movement, right? And then like that. So you ride fast because you start walking, ride fast, and then show some tendency, you know, dynamic tendency. But still, you can very easy to tell from this, right? From this, only those two strokes become kind of one stroke. And even uh, some broken, uh, still, I mean, the chi connected. Okay, let's look at the, the cursive one. Ooh, this cursive one <laughs> really <laughs> cursive, but still, um, I will analyze it. Yeah. Do you have can out print out or are you are looking at the screen? Yeah. Okay, this is the cursive one. See the upper part of the fields is really become simple, especially the center center thing. But the middle part, like the uh, slant and the press, still can see, right? Uh, and the bottom part very connected. I mean the very bottom one, the two strokes shows the you know talking talking each other direction kind of these things. but you can tell where it's come from. So the, it's like the, uh, uh, um, uh, uh, uh. So the very top part, see this vertical, I mean this vertical one become very small and connect very, with the horizontal one and the back to do a little bit indicated the center one and then become those two and yeah the most simplified part uh, is the top part so back kind of the, to the center and make a little bit of circle to indicate everything like the cross in the center. Yeah, so I analyze it and you, you know the principle, so you do it not every time, just, you know, the same thing. But like the bottom thing, you know, there's still two strokes kind of the slant kind of the vertical, it's still two strokes there. So the bottom, bottom, I mean the top one shouldn't be, you know, too flat because it's the a box like the field, right? You try to keep the, uh, the shape because you know where it's come from, right? So the like the box field uh, on the top, try to feel kind, feel kind of the round, but kind of still of the a little bit of squarish, not the perfect circle, right? Um, and those two strokes in the middle, you know, where it's come from. So try to keep the direction of that even very connected. 
and the bottom one, yeah, try to keep the direction, you know, the whole shape, the shape. I always say some uh, are plastic, uh, so uh, very flexible you can do and uh, but some rules, some principles that you know the reason uh, that you will do it correct. Okay, so and now I will do things, uh, see the world, world, you know, uh, put them together, the characters, and I will uh, do the things like one phrase, see if you can uh, recognize it, and we learn all the character we learned already, we try to do the uh, horizontal one first. the five characters and uh, what's that we learned did we what's that anybody knows that one yes <laughs> yes 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 easy ha huh? What's that? Flower. Correct. <laughs> Flower. Again. The word, uh, the, the, the word that we learned today, uh, world. So directly translation. Can you see that? You, you have a problem? Can you see my, my desk? Yeah, but you're frozen on my end. Oh yeah? Oh, uh, now, now you're not. But okay. You're okay, okay. Can you see that? So directly translate as one flower, one world. Uh, I think Henry, you said, um, what's the? <laughs> so the, um, actually this is a, uh, um, the next, uh, the next uh, um, sentence or next phrase is uh, um, one leaf, one um, body. You know the tree? The body is the tree. The body is the tree. Uh, so um, I, I think uh, how, uh, I don't know, um, my um, inter uh, interpretation is just a uh, common, not a poem, just from one flower, even very small thing, one flower, um, you can see the whole world. <laughs> so this is a good phrase, you can do the calligraphy, and also when you do painting, um, yeah, you can write this. And uh, um, Harry, um, on the chat room, you can help me too. We have also the mood seal, say that, right? One flower, one world, simply just. Okay, um, let me do a vertical one.
Victoria, may I ask a question? Yes. Um, what's the, you're, for me, you're going in and out for, as far as freezing goes. But so what is the difference between the last two characters in the sentence, the little phrase you just did? Um, put together on um, our, um, the world, well, the world. And oh. uh, by itself, I think I wrote a couple of the translation for the meaning there uh, on the handout. So this character, um, the first we learned today uh, is also means life, generation. So for those meaning, the second characters, um, it doesn't have. And the second character, we say with the bamboo leaves, with the fields on the top, that one um, has the other meaning of like the boundary, border, the meaning of that. But this meaning, the first character with the generation life, they don't have. So put them together means the world, world. Okay. So the world, in other words, the world, um, I, I don't know, because the language, the words thing, not just uh, word plus word the meaning put together uh equal equal to perfect equal to the word when they put them together so you can think of the world with life and with some i don't know should i say border boundary or some things like the fields thing you know the fields the natural fields thing uh yeah put them together well uh world world mm -hmm. but by itself there are, are some different other uh, meanings different mm -hmm. thank you uh-huh kathy right okay i will write again um vertical you know, vertical kind of hard to keep it straight sometimes. And you look at the whole thing, sometimes you can adjust a little bit when you write. This is very simple and very easy to remember. <laughs> Grass top, right? Ah, uh, it's off the screen, huh? Yeah, when you write like the phrase together, um, of course, it doesn't have to be, I mean, each character's the same size. Mm -hmm. And especially um, when you write the vertical or some things, the last one, or sometimes in between, can be longer, um, can be longer or shorter, you decide. Mm -hmm. Actually, I think this one is too wide here. For this, um, the, the, the size of the paper better. Stand up, stand up you can see the whole, whole thing uh, better. Anyway. Just to do the sample, also my practice. So uh, you can do yours. This is a good phrase though, anyway. Um, you can do on the flower painting or just to do the calligraphy. Uh, yeah, for the whole thing. 
or they write the small characters use a small brush on the side of your painting. So when you do, I think last uh, last time um, I answered Susan Susan Mary's question, uh, the order of uh, the traditional uh, the calligraphy writing when you do vertical uh, from, uh, of course, from top to the bottom, uh, if vertical. But when you do um, several lines, still uh, right to uh, left, I mean, the right line top to the bottom and the second line bottom, I uh, mean the top to the bottom and the third line, line to line from right to left and the top to bottom. Okay, and uh, any question? May I ask a question about last one of last week's characters? Uh, yes, what's the question? It, it, it relates to what you said of today about the straight, like for the straight one for world and how hard it is to make the straight ones look beautiful. Uh -huh. and so the, the walking style, uh -huh. I think it was the walking style of Hill has a lot of straight ones, but it's, but they're at an angle and it's so beautiful. I couldn't do it at all. Um, it is, uh, yeah, I don't, I, I, I don't understand the, what's the uh, difficult points for you to uh, do. I say you cannot do. It is hard uh, even for um, yes. the, the Chinese people. Um, okay. Yeah. Very, very hard. And uh, especially I think uh, for the Western people never, you never seen the order, I mean, the vert, vert, vertically, uh, you mean, to do that. Uh -huh. And uh, for the English, never never do that, right? It's impossible. But um, that's not the, not the, pop, not the problem here, yeah, just in, in line, just in line, try to keep it straight. And uh, um, I said, um, probably um, you, uh, uh, hand, uh, I mean, handing the, homework and I didn't get chance to to see that yet. Yeah, sorry about that. I will do that later. Uh -huh. I didn't get it in time though. Uh -huh. Cause for uh, last two days. Uh -huh. Yeah. Yeah, I, I don't I don't have computer. <laughs> uh -huh. I, will, I will check it later. Uh -huh. And any, uh, any, any question? Other, yes, yes, Charlie. Uh, on that horizontal stroke, yeah. it is very difficult. Uh, the beginning of it in particular is difficult because does it have a little bit of a point or is it rounded or is it pushed down and then lifted and then pulled across? You know, it's... Um, I have trouble with that stroke also. Um, and I'm never really quite sure uh, if it's supposed to have a little bit of a point, you know, on the left hand, upper left hand part. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Actually for, um, um, when you practice, we always say the point like a point, like the dot there, uh, pause enough, and then go, right? And then go. You think this part, right? Yes, yes. <laughs> this part. part, yeah. Especially standard size, standard yeah. size. Mm -hmm. We do that. Um, try to um, show your and try to um, to let you know very clear for the practicing of the choreography stroke. So press and then change direction to the where you want to go and then go. Oh, okay. This kind of things. Mm -hmm. But did you notice the um, see the handout for the walking style and uh, for the um, 
uh, especially uh, cursive style, the this part you said the very difficulty uh, for this part. This part doesn't really show very clear. Sometimes, yes. Yeah, sometimes just um, uh, you know directly directly touch right directly touch and very quick started to go mm -hmm. uh, because of uh, what because of uh, mm, especially the whole thing whole character or when you write uh, uh, faster or when you write the uh, two words to two word together two characters together you're thinking of the whole things and uh, you prepared some things in the air or previously already, and then you start to go. Since you go for the whole thing, so the faster. Not very showy here, but ready for the whole thing. I mean, stored already, and the, then go. So, um, doesn't show that much because there is a long way to go and the whole thing to consider. So it doesn't um, pause here a lot. But still, if your rhythm want to show things very clear, or you say, I just want to, you know, I, I, I can do that for like the, for example, like the, uh, the the phrase uh, we just do the, I can do. Oh, I want to go. And then go fast. See this one I didn't do very. You know, sometimes you can do like your rhythm. Um, I want pause here, like the music, like the music. Uh huh. I want pause here. I'm thinking of things further, and then when I ready, I go something faster. Here, I small small pause or my rhythm just you know, some short breath, short breathing, and then continue to go. So it doesn't have to show everywhere, even, even the starting part. Um, some people, you know, do just uh, directly touch and, uh, but uh, got enough preparing, preparing things for the mood and uh, for the rhythm previously, even in the air. You see, lots of time when the choreographer, they do things, doesn't touch paper and uh, but in the air holding the brush for a while and then go not like you got the ball pen and the directly right in the air for a while you know thinking of things the, the whole image of things and decided to go so prepare in the air already doesn't very shows this part on the paper depend on your reason, where you want to put your pause and where for some things continue very fast, doesn't very show. Or I can, from the very beginning, do I can do this as well. Doesn't have to be, doesn't have to show that, but for the whole thing. Or when you do the standard style, you want to Think of consider of everything. You 
you can do stroke by stroke. I can only see Catherine. I can't see the Victoria. Huh? I can't see you at all. Oh, you can. Uh, uh, now, uh, screen is now, on my uh, in, on, on my on my desk. Can you see my writing, my paper? Before I couldn't. When you did it. Um, now you now you get it. Oh, probably when I um, use the edge of the paper is out of, out of the screen. So I read it from the left to right. Now people, some people do that. One. Other, other, one other uh, world, world interesting to show you. What's that? What's that? Life flowers or world flowers? Flower, flower, world. Right. Guess what's the what, what, what's the meaning for that? If you put four characters together, <laughs> lots of flowers in the world. <laughs> what uh, a flower, flower together when it's two flowers together. Uh. How to translate it, Henry? Do you do 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 you know how to translate it? <laughs> He's trying to find in Google. <laughs> yeah, the direct meaning, uh, of course, from the world, from the characters we learned already. Flower, flower world, but uh, yeah. What's that? Okay, um, it's what's that? Well, anyway, uh, of course, the character is a flower, flower, lots of a flower, and uh, colorful, and uh, um, uh, okay. When we were in China, and especially um, uh, like before, 
an uh, electric cultural revolution and uh, uh, close the door. Um, we uh, we we call we call ourselves uh, ourselves in China as um, uh, we think is very conservative, uh, very an uh, old tradition, very simple uh, life, and uh, we call Western style. We call um, American. Uh, what kind of the uh, country, what kind of the world, world um, we, we specially call this uh, flower, flower world. Uh -huh. And we also, we call like a big city, um, like uh, we call Shanghai. You, you heard about the Shanghai, right? The, the, the city, uh, Shan, uh, uh, Shanghai and the Tokyo. Uh, and New York, this kind of is a uh, flower, flower world. <laughs> but mostly not, not the, not the um, nature thing. It's kind of the, uh, the social, uh, and the, human, the human being thing, and uh, the society thing. Um, how can I explain? Um, Henry says he put the <laughs> explain, explanation in yeah, the chat room. Uh, it says a word of central pleasures. Okay. Very colored word. Very colored word. A uh, very word colored of, uh, world. <laughs> yeah, word. Word of central pleasures. Okay. And uh, very, in very, very, very interesting. So um, when my uh, my mother, um, I said uh, she was a um, professor, right? Uh, she got only one one job in the university um, to uh, to teach all her life. Just one 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 job for um, like fifty more than fifty fifty years. Uh, to teach, of course, uh, uh, later la later uh, retired, and uh, when um, he got the education and all her oh, she I'm sorry well, all her life um, is uh, you know uh, uh, um, I mean um, American um, is the of course a Western country. And uh, even um, like before uh, seventy, uh, before se before seventies, um, and uh, we didn't even uh, got the um, uh, to go any chance to go uh, to to come to the uh, U.S. And uh, when my mother in the middle middle school, uh, she learned foreign languages English, and uh, when um, she went to the university, got education. Um, English is not even allowed uh, to learn um, as a class in China. You, you, know, you know that, right? Because the relationship uh, is broken. Uh, the only language, foreign language she learned, she learned is changed. I mean, uh, from English to the um, Russia, Russian, so yeah, so become only Russian allowed become a foreign language to learn in her university. You, you mm. understand that, right? And then um, recovered the relationship in the 70s. And then of course, um, um, uh, uh, I came to the e US and uh, uh, she visit, uh, vi visit, her, vis visit us and uh, um, uh, I, I asked I asked her um, uh, why you want to um, come to the uh, do you want to come to the U.S. and the visit and the why you want to come to the uh, uh, U.S. Um, I'm the at um, retire retired age because um, and the main uh, information uh, she got in her. On education and, and all the information is American uh, was not good, you know, was not a good country. And uh, 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 chi uh, China uh, is 
the best. <laughs> uh, so and close the door, you know, uh, uh, we are we are the best be confident to be proud of our country, you know. <laughs> And I said, why you, why you want to come to the U.S.? And she uh, smiled and she said, uh, I want to see the, this flower, flower world. I want to see what, what does it look like? I want to, I really want to see it. Oh, interesting. I remember. <laughs> so that's what she's. That's what she said, they came to US, want to see the flower, flower world. <laughs> other, uh, other, word, uh, other word in interesting, I'm thinking about. I didn't get enough space. I didn't arrange good. Okay, so this flower, flower, and this is uh, uh, like the grandpa or female. This is the Single word is the sun, right? Did we learn? Yes, I think sometimes uh, we uh, uh, I learn I, I put together. And uh, Henry, do you know how to how to translate it? Put put them together. <laughs> but put them together as boy. So flower, flower, boy, playboy. <laughs> playboy, okay. Yeah, so this is a female. I mean male, I'm sorry. And also, um, yeah, if we also call the grandfather or more male, in general male. Okay, just to show you some uh, some 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 funny yeah uh, the combination or the the phrase the world world for four characters and some word we learned already and have other meaning though the flower flower uh, the flower uh, and the flower flower two put together can be <laughs> what kind of the meaning and. Uh, you can tell from the original meaning a little bit, and if you put together <laughs> something interesting. <laughs> yeah, any questions? Any questions? Welcome to ask. And we call uh, some like some of the cloth, uh, some of the cloth. If we use uh, flower cloth, which means floral, floral. You know, floral. Yeah, floral. Uh, the cloth cloth doesn't uh, has to be the specific flower mm -hmm. means floral. With lots of a pattern. So you're speaking of material with lots of flowers on yes, it. Yes, yes. Make a dress from or something. Right, right, okay. right. Okay, uh, I think the time is uh, over the class. We talk about a lot. And uh, if you do not have a question, um, yes, I will let you go and uh, see you next class. I will 
do the uh, homework. I will check if somebody sent it for the last class. And uh, sorry about the late late for that. <laughs> thank you. Okay, thank you. Victoria. I have a question to Charlene. Charlene, are you there? Charlene, yeah. 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 I have a question for you. You have, you have, you have um, something, is it from Guatemala? You have um, something on the 